Today, I thought it would be fun to go through the Target 2017 toy catalog. This is out for Christmas, and we just got it in the mail, and I'm sure a lot of you got it in the mail as well. But the reason I want to go through it is because some people do not live near a Target and you, if even if you don't live near a Target, it's okay because if you see something in here you like, all you have to do is go online and you can order it online. So, you know, if you do have a Target and you have a Target red card like we do and you save 5% with every order, then I'm sure you will be getting one of these in the mail. Uh, in this catalog, you will see as we go through, there are Target exclusives. Just like if you watch the Toys R Us catalog that I went through, there were Toys R Us exclusives. Target has their own exclusives as well. This Spy Operation Escape Room is a Target exclusive. This Rival Gun, this particular Spider-Man, um, the, they're only at Target, um, so just like with the Toys R Us. Uh, so, this is pretty cool. It is a Shopkins Shoppies Shopville. Shopkins Shoppies Shopville. Say that three times fast. Super Mall Playset. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Uh, it is on sale for $75 right now. So, that's nice. And then you have a Star Wars set, too. Um, so, I'm not going to talk about each item because we would be here all day long if I did. So I figured that if I saw something cool, then I would talk about it. If you see something cool that you want to read about, please just pause the video. I'm going to try to get all the prices and stuff in here. I also figured somebody wanted to know why I was filming the Toys R Us book. And um, I will tell you now, the reason I'm filming this is because um, not everyone has a Target near them, like I said. Also because in other countries, uh, you might not have a Target. And I think it's neat to see what is available in America versus what's available in your country. In Australia or Canada, you know, I, th I think it's uh, neat to see what's available other places. That is so cute. I have never seen a set like that before. I've seen many uh, sets. But that's Melissa and Doug Diner. That is so cute. And the little kids can actually sit in the diner seats. Now, it's $190, but that's really nice. Okay. Kevin, I talked about this during the Toys R Us book. I talked about seeing this, and I think this is so cool. If I was into Minecraft, this would be the thing to buy. I would, have, like, have the whole set. Now, I'm not into Minecraft, so I won't be getting it. And Kevin loves Minecraft, but Kevin um, does not play a, uh, a game like this. Kevin pl A console, yeah. Kevin plays on the computer. And now, if Kevin could get a computer like that then he probably would. <laughs> he probably would go for a computer like that. Uh, but I haven't seen any of those yet. Now, that doesn't mean that they don't make them, but I haven't seen them yet. These are the Lego Dimensions. This is a Anki. Is that how you say that name? Anki Overdrive. That looks pretty cool. Once again, if you see anything you want to look at, then just pause it because... I'm not really into the electronics stuff, believe it or not, and I'm married to an electronics guy. That's why it works between us, because I know nothing about him, and he knows everything, and so if I need help, then he can fix it. He can make it right. So, what are these? Oh, this is just the phone. I thought it was maybe a cover for the phone. Okay, here's the phone cases. Ashley Mary phone cases. I've never heard of those before, but I'm sure a lot of you have heard of them. Heard of them. Um, Beats uh, earbuds. Okay, I'm completely uh, did not know. I knew that they came like big headphones. I did not know that they made earbuds. So that's I'm sure I'm the only one in the universe that did not know that. 
and let's see what else I have. I'm sure you learn a lot about me watching these videos because you learn um, that Tammy doesn't know much about electronics. That Kevin's the one that sets everything up for her. <laughs> so this is a Garmin. And then you have the Fuji Instant uh, cameras. And I'm sure that gets expensive. It says the film alone is $13.49. I personally would rather, yeah, you get the camera for seventy, and then the the film is thirteen forty nine. I would rather buy a camera like I have, which was very expensive. However, it's it's a one time thing. You know, you're buying it, and uh, and that's it. This is cool. This is like the projectors that we used to look at, except you would look in there and see the picture. This, you actually shine it up on your wall. I like that a lot. That's nice. And you get the different, uh, I'm assuming different cartridges for it. This is a Letters to Santa. Santa special paper transforms letters into keepsake ornaments, it says. Okay. And then they have the Star Wars section. I noticed, um, you know how the Target has the, the big red balls as you're walking in the door on each side of the door to Target? Uh, like a month ago, they had those covered in this droid. And so now they've already taken them off. And, and I thought they were up there for Halloween. And Kevin said, oh no. He said, that was a promotion. Uh, but I thought it would have been cool to leave it up for Halloween. Or they could make them something for Halloween. They could make them into pumpkins or anything like that. That would be cool. But I don't know why they don't take advantage of those. So, you have these masks, which I think are cool. I also think it's really, really neat that, like, when Kevin and I were growing up, you had to wait till Halloween if you were going to wear a costume. You, you're not going to find any Halloween costumes before Halloween. Now, they sell costumes in the toy aisle. You can get uh, the mask. You can get the cape. Uh, you can wear this stuff year round. Your kid can be any superhero that he wants to be. And those men are awesome. $45 Justice League. But look at the detail on them. At least in this picture, that looks like a really nice set. Uh, but yeah, you can be, your child can be a superhero year round. And I think that's cool. Andrew used to have a jacket that buttoned down. And he would button that jacket around his neck. And he wouldn't put his arms in the sleeves. So he had it behind him and he, he put it around his neck and would fasten the button. And that would be his cape. And he would go in the store. He was so proud. He thought he was something in that. Uh, but now, kids, you can just buy them the cape. So, they still... Cars is still really popular. And I'm glad because I, I love these movies. Um, I would sit down and watch these movies anytime. I think they're really, really good movies. Okay, this surprises me a little bit. That they have uh, the drone... Um, because, I don't know, in some places, some places are funnier than others about drones. And, uh, so like, like if you big, if you live in a big city and you're getting this magazine and they show you, I mean, are drones selling in big cities like they would be selling like around here? I don't know. I have no idea. Okay, and then, this is the rival gun that's only at Target. Which is really nice. I like that. That one uh, shoots balls. Yeah, uh, it's $25. That's not bad at all. And then you have the Pokemon. And you know, Kevin did the uh, Kevin did the Pokemon Go for a little while. Is that what it's called, Pokemon Go? He did that for a little while. And um, he didn't stick with it long, though. It got to be... You know, the thing with us is we go, when we go for a walk, we go around the same area every single time. And Kevin likes it that way. I would go, 
look at this. This game, it's called the cat game. It actually has fur sticking out of it. It's actually kind of disturbing when you see it in person. Because uh, it's like they put a cat in a box. Anyway, Pokemon Go. So, we, since we go around the same place every time, we don't go new places, um, we were getting the same exact Pokemon every single time we went out, and we were never getting anything new. So, unless you were willing to go, uh, I don't know, it seems like we had to go to a gym, or there was a gym, or something with a gym, unless you were willing to invest a little bit more time in it and go someplace and just sit you weren't gonna get it and um, even though I would walk I would walk all over town Kevin really likes to have a start and end point he likes to know where he's going so um, we just usually go to the same places now they had lots of these in the Toys R Us ad and I said in that video these are a learning walker if your child's not walking yet, uh, this is awesome. Um, they have a kid, Kitty Zoom Smart Watch. And Kitty Buzz Max. I guess that's a phone that only does kids games maybe or music. And like the Toys R Us, they have a Play-Doh set. Mega Construction. That has the Despicable Me. That's Drew's Lair. Um, Kevin and I just watched, uh, not that long ago, Despicable Me 3, and it was hysterical. I just, I thought it was so funny. Uh, it was a really good movie. Those are, those are some other movies that I would watch again. Um, Despicable Me. I really like them. They, they actually, I actually laughed out loud a couple times. Uh, maybe that's immaturity, I don't know. But I just, I think they're really funny movies. Okay, and then they have the Crayola, once again, just like Toys R Us, except uh, they're showing you some different ones. And then they have, this looks like a more adult coloring set because it's, uh, it's a lot more detailed. Now, I have not seen this one before. Uni Uniclorn. It's not un... Well, okay, there's a typo. I found a typo in the Target app. It's called Unicorn Slimy Goop. They put Uniclorn, C-L-O-R-N, Slimy Gloop. So, that's just a typo in their book. But, I've never heard of Unicorn Slimy Goop. That sounds really really weird okay and then we have the uh, lego this only a target october 29th through november 4th that's interesting so you're gonna get if you spend 30 dollars or more on lego you get this free lego batman keychain so you have to spend 30 or more this is um November 12th through the 18th, if you spend 30 or more, which that looks boring as can be to me, but whatever. Um, now, this looks cool. November 5th through the 11th, if you spend 35 or more, you get the... Um, it says receive a free Lego Christmas tree. So, it, it doesn't say anything about those characters free. It says the Christmas tree itself. So, I don't know if it comes with those characters or not. If it does, that would be a really good one to try to get. November 19th through the 25th, you spend 30 or more and you get a free Lego Jolly Santa with purchase. So, he looks kind of uh, like a Muppet with those eyes, doesn't he? Okay, and then we have the Ninjago. And then more Lego. And you can even, if you don't want to get the fancy sets, you can even get the classic Lego set. This one is only at Target, and it is a sailboat rescue. It's $24 on sale. You don't see Lego go on sale very often. You really don't. It's hard. It's hard to get them on sale. This is, a, I guess, the newest Minecraft uh, set. And this looks really cool. This is a Friends Heart Lake Hospital. 
It's $90, but that's nice. Really nice. Okay, loving the fluff. This is uh, some stuffed animals. Uh, we saw this, uh, a bigger version in the Toys R Us ad. I think those are those fingerlings that we saw. Yeah, those were in the Toys R Us ad. And then it looks, so they have some bigger, a little ladybug playset, little hedgehog house. And surprise chick house. That's her surprise face. She's really surprised. <laughs> and Shopkins. Which I love the colors of these. Look at the cars. Those are so cute. <laughs> I love that. That's Happy Places High School Playset. $27. I that's, that's something that I would like to play with. I would play with that. With these cars. I like all that. And then you have the Num Noms. And these are cute. But I like those Shopkins. But oh, those are cute though. I like those. The Tots dolls. I don't think I've ever seen those. Those are adorable. And they come in, in these balls like this. Every layer. Okay, so you get it. And then you take off a layer. And then you don't know which doll you're going to get. That is awesome. I love that. I'm assuming that's what that is. Okay, and then you have Zoom Zooms, which Ashley loves these. Okay, they have two advent calendars, which I have only seen, I think, one of these advent calendars. I think I've only seen the original Zoom Zoom calendar. And this one is really cool. This is a superhero one. And it is Zoom Zoom, but it's just Zoom Zoom with superheroes. Normally, it's $40. Now, it's $38. So, you're saving $2 if you get it now. So, you can see they don't really put, put them on sale. The, I mean, that's not much of a savings, $2. Um, I wish it was more than that. Because uh, I would have gotten one for Ashley, but I can't bear to spend $40 on that. And yes, I did say Ashley, because Ashley likes the Zoom Zooms. I like them too. Okay, we saw this tree playset at Toys R Us, but the Toys R Us one, I'm almost positive, was bigger. I'm pretty sure it was bigger. This is called uh, DreamWorks Spirit. That all goes with that. And they have exclusive colors at Target. And then we have the Barbie. And Barbie Rockers. And I told Kevin, after I finished looking at the Toys R Us book, I said, you know what I didn't see? I didn't see any Monster High in the Toys R Us book. And I didn't see any Ninja Turtles. So, I'm wondering if I'm going to see any Monster High or Ninja Turtles in this book. It will be very interesting to me because, I mean... I, I love Monster High. Does that mean that Monster High is not as popular now? Because I think they're still really cool. That baby is adorable. Baby Moana. And look, you can buy the outfit and dress as Moana. That's a nice house. That Disney Frozen house. It's $110. But that's, I mean, it's huge. You see how big this little girl is. And she's standing next to it. That's that's a big house. And then we have our generation dolls. And these are like the American Girl dolls. And I have seen these things in the store. I'm trying to get the prices in the bottom so you can see them. I've seen these in the store and these are big. <laughs> these things, Kevin's like, oh my gosh, those are huge. They are huge and if you got them, they would take up a lot of space. Um... That's something Ashley never had was American Girl. But I know a lot of you all collect them. So, that is cool. That's a camper. And this is called Lori. Which, I don't remember ever having Lori when I was a kid. And then this is like the Calico Critters. Or the Sylvanians, if you're in the United Kingdom. Uh, these are called Little Woodsies. And this is the Target version. This the They are 
uh, cheaper. They're not cheap. They're still not cheap, but they are cheaper than uh, the calico critters. And these are all only at Target. Give them a beat, it says. And uh, they're glowies. Beat bugs. <laughs> And then we have Paw Patrol. So clearly Paw Patrol is still popular. Now, once again, I have passed the girl stuff and I did not see Monster High. So somebody needs to tell me what's going wrong. Oh no, here's some more stuff. Okay, maybe we'll see them back here. Only at Target. This is the uh, My Little Pony set. I have uh, actually seen that collection there. Wonder what her name is. Singing Songbird Serenade. That's what it says that is. Look at this one. This one has a mermaid tail. That's not a pony. Pinkie Pie Swimming Sea Pony figure. That's cool. Yeah, that looks so bizarre. <clears throat> okay, this is a Peppa Pig set. And they have this huge set. I believe we saw that at Toys R Us. And then they have Disney Junior. They have the Minnie Mouse set. This is very, very cute. And um, we saw a cart like that. We saw the Doc McStuffins. But I think this is, yeah, this is the same cart that we saw at Toys R Us. I don't know if it's cheaper or not. I haven't, I haven't compared any prices. And then this is the uh, Melissa and Doug. And... Uh, when Gavin was little, we got him a set, a cleaning set, and he loved that thing. And it has a cart, and you can roll it around, and if you watch my old videos, you would see him rolling it around. He loved that thing. Now, this dollhouse says it's only at Target. It is the Glendale Manor dollhouse. It is $75 on sale. Regular $79. So, really, I mean... Okay, it's five bucks off, but really, I mean, that's not a huge, they're, they're putting sale in, in, um, you know, they're putting that in bigger letters, bolder letters, but really, it's only a couple dollars off. I haven't seen anything like you have to go to the sale or you're just going to miss out and feel terrible about yourself. No, it hasn't been that way. It's been like, okay, two dollars, five dollars. Not a big deal. Okay, then we have the sports, the sports stuff. And I am horrible at ping pong. I'll tell you that right now. Kevin and I like, uh, what is that, ice hockey? Table. table hockey. Air hockey. Air hockey. Is it air hockey? Air hockey. We love air hockey. And we can actually <laughs> build up a, a sweat playing air hockey because... We're so competitive with each other. Okay. So let me get some prices in here for you. Hopefully you all can see these prices. You know, I'm just I'm just trying to film this. And then there's a some bikes just like at Toys R Us. Hopefully though by watching these videos you can you can compare prices if you want to. Or you can see, okay, Target has these cars. Uh, what cars did Toys R Us have? I think Toys R Us probably has a leg up on these. Just different kinds. Maybe not prices, but, but a different variety because I think they have more space to put them. Okay, and so this is, what are they showing here? Oh, they're showing clothes. Okay, we didn't see any clothes in the Toys R Us. Although, our Toys R Us sells clothes and they sell some really, really cute clothes. I only go to the sale racks because I don't want to pay full price for them because they're expensive. But my camera cut off. It, it came to, I must have been filming for 25 minutes. Um, what I was saying is I absolutely love Target clothes. Uh, I think they have the cutest clothes. And every time we go past the girl section, <coughs> Kevin and I both wish that Ashley could fit into those clothes uh, because they're so adorable. We always bought Ashley stuff at Target. 
so we do miss uh, miss being able to put her in these clothes and sometimes she'll go by there herself and she'll be like oh I wish I could still fit into that <laughs> so they have pajamas and everything they have some really cute stuff look at this this is Cat and Jack Hooded Blanket Sleepers. I like that Cat and Jack brand. Uh, we bought Gavin and Amelia both Cat and Jack. And then the last page, here we are. Um, they just have um, some more of those little LOL surprises and Moana. And So this is it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, now you can see what Target has and maybe you, if you want to compare it, you can go back and compare the things that you saw in this book to the things at Toys R Us. So I hope you found it helpful and I'll catch you next time.